Well, hello everybody. Hello, 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 and welcome back. So, today we're going to we're going to check out a new game, uh, Control, which I picked up in the today in the February PS Plus free games. So I thought we'd give it a try and do a let's play of it, and I hope you all like it. I mean, I have absolutely no idea what this game is about. I'm going into this completely blind. So please uh, let me know um, if I'm doing okay as I'm going along. So, um, new game. Okay. All right then. Let it begin. New bureau employees often get lost in the shifting corridors of the oldest house. When in doubt, look for green direction signs and consult the map. Okay. That's cool. Getting tips and hints already. Definitely. <laughs> definitely something that I'm probably going to need. Hopefully there's a good tutorial. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing this completely blind, guys. I have no idea what to expect. I'm probably going to die a few times. That tends to happen. But yeah, let's... Uh, let's go. Fair warning. This is going to be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that... Oh, okay. I get my hopes up. Oh, okay. So many times it's led to nothing. This must be the building that they were talking about. Nothing. In the clue. It's like... We live in a room. And there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. Federal world. Federal Bureau of Control. And the poster. Control what? The what are we controlling? Something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie. What is it called? The prison movie. It's probably a lot of those. The room's a cell. And the picture, it's different. For each of us, it can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. Oh, <laughs> but it's all a lie. Okay. Something to distract us from the truth. That's a creepy picture. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. Hmm. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I guess this is our protagonist. I'm here. I have no idea Why what's going to happen. Here? Hmm. Who? Okay. All right. Hello. Indeed. Hello. Anyone here? Okay. So yeah, pretty standard there. Moving, adjusting camera. Oh, I'm, I got a run button. Woo! Well, not a button. <laughs> it's not a button. It's a control. All right. So the white dot would probably be the 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 go-to place. Is that square? Oh, I gotta hold it. Okay. Correspondence. Prohibited items reminder. Open. Open. Book thing. Okay. Collectibles. Hmm. Reminder. Certain objects are not allowed inside the bureau. 
Recent incidents have nece necessitated an issued reminder on prohibited materials. Wow. Smartphones, smartwatches, game con gaming devices. Wow. Okay. All material under bureau investigation is to be brought in through the private entrances. If you see any lobby personnel in breach of these policies, please notify your supervisor. Wow. Interesting. All right. Uh, where do I go now? I mean, this does look like a very federally building, but it, it, it just appears... Oh, uh, okay. The door just randomly opened. Let's go into the creepily, spookily ghost door that randomly opened for us. Interesting. What do we got here? What's that say? Internal lockdown in effect. Huh. All right. Internal lockdown. Wonder what's going on. Not nothing good, obviously. Uh, I don't see any collectibles or anything to pick up here. Nothing at all. I mean, I get. I guess I just have to go out then and move on. I guess we uh, go up these stairs. Oh, God, that's a horrible design. A horrible color. Horrible design. Ugh. Red? Red ca Oh, uh, red carpet? No. Mind you, I, I don't have carpets in my house. Um, I mean, it doesn't, it, it doesn't help that I live in Spain, so... <laughs> okay, bureau expenditures. What do they spend... What do they waste their money on? Oh, okay, it's even uh, redacted. Major things like staffing, surveillance, something, data center initiative, construction, minor office equipment, janitorial. <laughs> Poor janitors considered minor costs. <laughs> that doesn't seem very fair. <laughs> All right. Um, oh, we got another so item here. I saw it a long time ago. Hmm. I keep seeing it in my dreams. That's a little creepy. Jesse. A little bit creepy. Alright. Um, so we came up there. So While running L3 to sprint. Okay. That's a terrible picture. Oh. There we go. Refocused. Oh. I wonder who this guy is. Looks like some sort of head of research. Do Dr. Casper Darling. Oh my god, if that's not a Hollywoody type game name, then I don't know what is. Okay, there we go, sprinting. Who's this? What's this? Uh, your our bureau at work. Okay. I wonder what this bureau does. I guess we'll find out soon. Okay, who's this guy? Uh, the director. Okay. Um, so we can go that way. What about this way? Oh, these doors. They must be sensitive. Is there anything we can collect in here? Nope. Na oh, nada. Nothing. Alright. Um, let's... Uh, Let's uh, go towards the office. I guess that's probably where we need to go. Of control. Yeah. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. Ah, seems very mysterious. Very creepy. And it also looks like people left in a rush. Oh, that's not a door. <laughs> that's like an invisible window. Ah! Okay. More windows, more windows, more windows. Food. Ooh, that looks delicious. Why are they all white? Okay. Uh, what do we got in here? Something, 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 anything. Oh, what do we got here? 
Security order. Okay. Correspondence. Reminder, certain object. Oh, that's the one we read earlier. Uh, okay. That is very informative. A shark in his... Mm, although secure... Mm, permission to... Mm, following basic protocol... Mm, shoot to kill. Okay, so they have permission to... Shoot to kill someone. Interesting. I hope that's not me. That would be very bad. We don't want to be... On the receiving end of a shoot to kill order. Okay. Uh, I mean... I'm liking the looks of this so far. I mean, it, it's it's creepy. Scare. No, I mean, I don't really... I'm not a big fan of horror. I don't know if this is a horror game. I thought it was more of an RPG. Well, I guess we'll find out. Uh, but yeah, I'm liking the look of it. It's mysterious, creepy. Makes you want to explore. Hello, as you all should know by now, the R4 reports are due by the end of the week. Alright, well, sorry boss, I ain't got mine. We're still waiting on them from a number of people. Yep, <laughs> that would be me. If you need an extension, please request from R4E from your supervisor. If you think you're exempt from filing an R4, then you'll need to get written permission from your department chief saying so. Remember, R4 is a mandatory under Section 75.2 of the Employee Manual. If your R4 requires interdepartmental claims, then please contact the appropriate department head. Darling, Marshall, Salvador, or Kirkland, as needed. They'll be busy on Thursday in their annual policy review. Interesting. So I wonder what this this bureau does. Hello. Maybe that. Oh. Maybe that's the mystery that we need to discover throughout the game. We we learn thing. We're gonna learn things as we go along. Hmm. Oh, someone's singing. La la li do. Oh, hello. It's another person. Excuse me. Isn't he the guy from the painting? There you are. Hear about the job? Eh? Janitor's assistant. Yeah, sure, you sure. To go to the interview. Sure. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. No, oh, I love, I love Where the retro you? headphones. I'm a janitor, by the way. <laughs> you work for me. You can <laughs> say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they do. You are my element. <laughs> there be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you heart. Okay. <laughs> I've done you really <laughs> jobs to know it makes us come off weird. You I'll really want me a friendly face in my book. I really want Somebody me to have this job. Face at all. <laughs> think about it. Did he just like read my mind? But that said, I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. Alright. Interesting. Well, looks like you're not doing a great job of mopping here, buddy. It's very messy. He must like be the most terrible janitor in the world. So yeah, as I was saying, I, I dig the the retro headphones. Reminds me of when I was young, uh, or even <laughs> Guardians of the Galaxy, and when Chris Pratt's character puts those headphones on, and or or when the the space alien. Steals them from him and, and doesn't know what they are. Ha. Uh, reminds me of that. All right. So let's um, gander further in. Didn't we just see these guys? Oh yeah, he's. Huh? I'm so confused. Very confused. Didn't I just? Come through that area? Huh. Yeah, that's like. Wow, this is confusing. <laughs> I'm easily confused, by the way, in case you didn't notice. The okay. cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. Behind they the told poster? Me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. I think there's a story there. Will you help? I will, Jesse. I will. Although, I think I'm you. So, yes. <laughs> hmm. Huh. 
this looks like some sort of seedy office in like uh, a seedy neighborhood. With seedy people. Oh my god, that's an old computer. Are we in the 80s, by chance? Is game set in the 80s? Hmm, interesting. Uh-huh. Oh, this is weird and, and creepy and... I like it! Hmm. Feels like I'm in a movie. I suppose that's what it, most games are going for nowadays. They want you to feel immersed in, like, in a movie. Oh, okay. We're back with Jesse. I don't know what that was all about then. Moment. You know what's on my yes, mind. Yes, you did. My baby brother, Dylan. Seventeen years since the men of this bureau took him. Ah, so it's a revenge mission. Uh, revenge is never always the best melody. I'm speaking from my last playthrough of Detroit Become Human. Revenge is never always the best. Okay, what's over here? Oh, something to read. What's my mission? Uh, welcome to the oldest house. Jesse Fadden arrives at the oldest house, the headquarters of the Federal Bureau of Control, to look for answers in the mysterious to the mysteries of her childhood. Interesting. Okay. Uh, Non-official. I will not be dis. I will not be disturbed. Cancel all my appointments for the day, for the rest of the week. I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one. Wow. Deep. Paranoid. Interesting. Maybe we'll meet this paranoid guy. What was that? Hmm. Investigate. Do we have any kind of weapons? I'm sure we're about to maybe learn the mechanics behind combat, I guess. Alright, let's go find out what that noise was. Hmm. Shit. Shit indeed. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, toggle map, okay. Oh, Do wow. To pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? Yes. Something's outside. Oh, was coming here on oh that's cool. On the map, you move around the different areas in real time. That's cool. Yeah, we should probably pick up the gun. Who the board? Uh, what? Hey! Where's the poster? Objects of How'd this happen? can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. <laughs> Jeez. Where am I? Oh, I have a health bar now. Okay. Interesting. Wonder how the health works in this game. Wonder if I have to recover it. If it comes back slowly. Oh, oh that was close. That was close. Jeez. Um, climb. Okay. Uh, jump and climb. There we go. Oh, that looks like a bad guy. Melees. Okay, so I gotta melee fight this guy with triangle. Well, that was simple enough. Died in one hit. Hope all the enemies are like that. Ooh, I have a gun there. The Let's take the gun. Yes, please. Oh! Oh! Yeah. We 
We are the chosen one. Okay. Now I have a gun. Fire service weapon, R2. Okay. Do that. Is there any kind of aim? Okay, so they have health bars. There we go. Ah! I, uh, what, was that an auto refill? Awesome, sweet! Okay. The service weapon regenerates auto. Wow, regenerates ammunition. So I don't have to worry about ammo. That is comforting. Oh, what do we got here? You, hello. I wonder if uh, headshots work. Doesn't appear so. Hey, where are you going? Oh my god, I'm terrible. Huh. Okay, that's cool. Hmm. It appears that this is going to stay with me the whole time, so at least I know where I'm going to be shooting. Where do I go now? Oh! Whoa! Damn! Take me a while to get used to. I'm not too good at shooting games. Oh, he has a weapon. Don't like that. Sounds like there's another one. Yep, this guy has a gun as well. Oh, wow, when that guy jumped out on me. Enemies drop health elements when damaged. Collect health elements. So, I guess those health elements are these little blue orbs on the floor. Or this, whatever this is. Hmm. So we are the chosen one. We can do that. It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me, and it was just noise, and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? Mm. I'm happy. Happy to be here. Why? No, we're not happy to be here. Things have quieted down outside. <laughs> Is it safe to go? We've just met the director who committed suicide. And be given a gun that's alive. How are you happy? What are you happy about in this situation? What what in this situation makes you happy? Whoa, that's very different to the last time. What in this makes you happy? Right, so I can go to the right here. No. Back out here then. Oh. Oh. Hello. That's a little creepy. I don't know. Seems like we're in some sort of fight with our own soul. You stopped it. You. Thank you. That was horror. I don't like you. Okay. Yo, dude. What was that? Okay, so it looks like I can have maybe a few guns with some mods. Interesting. I guess we'll come up to that later. So what's this? Multimedia. Darling presentations. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered 
world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. So this is the video we saw earlier. Remember to cover their connection to the astral plane. No. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. Lose and you're well. Fine. Thank you. I'm Dr. Darling, head of research, Federal Bureau of Control. You're fired, so essentially dead. Because you commit suicide. Interesting. Alright, I'm still confused. Um, this is very confusing so far. So we're definitely going to have to open our eyes and get used to what's going on. The object's form is variable. When bound, the object allows para-utilitarians para para utilitarian, to watch something. This object must only be bound by individuals seeking the role of the director, I guess. The object will determine something. If rejected, the, the applicant is terminated. So it kills the applicant. So it killed the director. All right. The object was discovered inside the oldest house in the room that is now used as the director's office. The popular hypothesis, blah blah blah, many forms throughout history. Da, 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 da. Molnir, Excalibur, Excalibur, Varanus, Varanastra, all weapons, blah blah blah, of their wielders. If objects of power are the convergence of forces based on the com collective subconscious, then this may be the original manifestation of that event. Interesting. So, as I was watching that video, it reminded me of um, Command and Conquer. Because it looked like it was an actual real video um, that they ingrained into the, the game. Which I thought was pretty cool. Alright, so, uh, is there any way you can tell me my mission? What do I have to do? Proceed further into the bureau. Okay. All right. Well, that fell over pretty easily. <laughs> okay. More read. There's a lot of collectible readings in this. Okay. Um, while pending any notifications of death related to the willow, please adhere to the following guidelines in the service. Regret prior will be remembered. Avoid Alaska scissors, blood, loss, forges. That's a strange list of words to avoid. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, and so let's get this map then. So where do I want to go? Maybe that, that that yellow that yellow dot there? Maybe. Guess that makes sense. Can I go in the elevator? A red light would tell me other I can't. Alright, so I've got to go the long way. Okay. Right, we go then. Actually, I should probably be wary. Probably just, these things are probably just going to randomly appear. What? Who are you? Okay. Oh, this guy has a level. This has a. This guy's a one above his head, so maybe he's the. That's his level. Oh, where's that coming from? Damn! Wow, I, that that almost killed me. Jesus! Damn! Wow! God damn! That is scary how effective that guy was. Alright, it appears the environment might be damageable. Okay. So yes, I want these health. What's that? We need to take these guys down. Whoa!
Yeah. Well, one thing I'm discovering is you don't get much life. So all these guys seem to have killed themselves. What's this? Personal mod. Empty slot. What's this? A health boost. Okay. I'll take that. I guess this are things to help you survive, get better. Just kill this guy here. I don't know if that was what I was supposed to do, but he was bugging me. Silly man deciding he wanted to hang himself. Alright, there was another collector. No, there wasn't. Oh, I hear voices, which... In a normal game, indicates an enemy. Where am I going? Going this way. More health. I don't know if I'm supposed to do this. Maybe someone can let me know. They seem to be the workers. Uh... Oh, this is ominous. Boom! In big letters, telling me exactly where I am. Okay. The sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss. The hiss. Burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right. It's Who are you talking to? Enemy. Who are we talking to? That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. All right. Wow. So, um, I'm going to end the video there, guys. Yeah, so, uh, it's good. It's, it's something different. I haven't played it, uh, this type of game for a while. Um, I am intrigued as to who this person speaking to me is, I, even though I know it's Jesse, but it seems to be, is it the gun? Is it, what is it exactly? And these bodies in the air, curious as to what they're doing. Do I shoot them? Don't I? Um, it seems like it's got a very complex story, which I'm keen to investigate. So, thank you guys very, very much for watching, and I hope I can see you again soon. Bye-bye!